an animal you can actually touch. <laughs> now that animal that you guys just saw is a python. It's called a bull python. Sometimes you see them at the pet store. They're only about a foot long. People don't realize it, but snakes grow all of their lives. That little snake, foot long at the pet store, three feet long now is going to grow to be seven feet long. So remember that when you go to the pet store. Again, face the audience, put your hands out like this, and look over your right shoulder. This is the cute animal you're really going to get a chance to take your picture with right here. <laughs> Are you okay with snakes? All right, good. Okay, these guys will tell you exactly what to do. Now, people ask us all the time, do snakes have a back bone? The answer is yes, they do. They have a bone that runs from the base of their head all the way down to the tip of their tail, and then those bones are surrounded with hundreds of muscles, and that's the way they scoot up trees. Remember, they don't have legs or feet like us, so they have to get up there somehow. Okay, Joshua, look this way, and everybody say, rats. All right. Now, in just a minute, you're going to have a really nice picture of you and that snake and all of your embarrassment at the Wildlife Experience Show. How about a round of applause for Joshua? I'll trade you the snake for the picture. Thank you. Thanks for volunteering. Be careful going down that step. Now, this is a 10 and a half foot red-tailed boa constrictor. It weighs about 50 pounds. This snake, too, at the pet store is only about a foot long, 10 and a half feet long now. And this snake is going to grow to be 18 feet long by the time it's all said and done. So remember, when you go to the pet store, really think about the animals that you're getting. How about a round of applause for our red-tailed boa and Joshua, too?